Energy's exhaust gas driven absorption chiller and eater, also referred to as CHP type utilizes exhaust gas from incinerator or a gas turbine to generate cooling and heating. Directly recovery of the exhaust gas with a minimal loss maximizes energy efficiency. CHP series are supplied to combined and heat power generation CHP facilities. CHP and HWA or LR used in CHP facilities. CHP utilizes exhaust gas waste heat to provide chilled and hot water. HWA or LR utilizes engine jacket water to provide chilled water. CHPL model, hybrid type absorption chiller, can use combination of engine exhaust gas and cooling water as a heat source. CHP absorption system recovers exhaust gas and provides cooling and heating in the following way. This process involves evaporator, absorber, condenser, low and high temperature generators, heat exchanger pipe and pump absorber and generator in absorption system or like mechanical compressor in electric chillers. Now following are the logistics of CHP absorption system. Inside the CHP chiller, refrigerant that cools down the inlet water is circulated by VPR solution. Heated after being used in cooling, chilled water flows through to evaporator, refrigerant evaporates and chilled water returns to the system. Vaporized refrigerant flows through to absorber, where it is mixed with the LeBR solution, the diluted solution from the absorber flows to high temperature generator. Diluted solution in generator is heated by exhaust gas heat, separating into refrigerant vapor and LeBR solution. Refrigerant vapor goes through low temperature generator and condenser, to be condensed and returned to generator. Solution goes through low temperature generator to release heat from refrigerant again and become concentrated solution, flowing to absorber. By repeating this cycle, the system cools down the chilled water which is then used for cooling. CHP systems heating works in a simpler logistics. Heated up by incoming exhaust gas in high temperature generator, the solution releases refrigerant into vapor, becoming concentrated solution which flows to absorber. High temperature vapor flows to evaporator, heating up incoming hot water. Vapor condensed to liquid by releasing heat, is then mixed into the solution in absorber flowing to high temperature generator, repeating the cycle. World Energy produces many more absorption chillers and heaters driven by a variety of heat sources and heat pumps. Maritime chiller and fuel cell heat exchange are also available. from industrial process or hot water from district heating and solar cell, high temperature steam are used to driven our chiller products. World Energy is the first in the world to commercialize absorption chiller for maritime and offshore plant application, contributing to lowering electric and fuel consumption. Utilizing cooling water readily available from the sea water, maritime and offshore application provides near cost-free cooling system. Even without waste here, absorption chiller can utilize fossil fuel in areas with low fuel cost to provide cooling and heating at low cost. If you would like more information about our company and our products, please access our website or contact us via email.